This may look like a symbiote, however, it's actually ferrofluid, a liquid developed by NASA to help transport fuel in low gravity environments. The cool thing about ferrofluid is that basically it's a bunch of iron particles suspended in a surfactant that prevents it from clumping up. So basically a bunch of tiny, tiny iron bits in a um, oil substance, essentially. It's a little bit more complicated than that, but yeah. Anyway, I want to see what would happen if I introduced ferrofluid onto the magnetic stirring plate. So let's see what happens when I put it on there. Okay, very interesting effect. Let me show you. Give you a top-down view on that one. All right, and then I'm going to start from really, really slow. This is like the slowest speed I can go. And then let's gradually crank it up there a little bit. Okay. All right. Okay. Oh. Very interesting. Turning it faster. A little bit more. All right, we're at about halfway now, which I find this to be very fascinating because it essentially allows you to visualize the magnetic fields. Okay, I'm gonna crank it up a little bit faster than it was. Oh, now it's going really fast. So it's not only really starting to distort because I think um, really can't keep up that well, I guess. Oh, maybe let's see if I put it more centered. Ooh, actually. There we go. Huh, very interesting phenomenon indeed. And I also wanted to try out some iron filings as well. We got some iron filings over here and we're gonna try those on the magnetic heat plate as well. I'm gonna put it into a Petri dish.